uh, everything I got today. This will be the first part of the video. I'll talk about this in the second part of the video, or vice versa. I don't really know. I already talked about this. I'll just edit the two videos together. Um, if you like live looking at stuff, live hunting, whatever you want to call it, uh, check my Scummer Resellers channel. I'll put that video up later. Um, I spent 55 plus 10 plus 15. So 55 and 25, and I think it's actually 51. 25, 45, 51. 51, 61, 71, 76. I spent $76 today on this. This table was a great buy. Uh, only $5. This is very, very heavy duty. Solid steel construction. S straight lines. No, it's a good table. I need it. I need a table for the store. And, uh, well, like a workstation or just where I can pile heavy stuff stuff on it you can see it, it's got like steel over here bracing it it's thick wood nothing's going to poke through and it's got the steel legs five bucks i mean come on no brainer had to buy that um aj if we don't use it in the front which we probably won't uh, we might use it temporarily in the front we will definitely use it in the back all right um i'll talk i'll talk about that last this is this exercise thing that Marie wanted. It's Brookstone. So, uh, Brookstone's a very high quality name. 20 bucks. She's going to use it. They had a bunch of DVDs, but I'm only looking for DVDs that are interesting or that I might want to watch. Well, uh, here's Police Academy 1, 2, 3, 4. I'll probably watch this. I mean, if I, I and after I watch it, I'll sell it. All right, this is the most interesting and, and I don't know, potentially the most valuable thing I got today. I, I really don't know. I learned about these from watching uh, other people's videos, right? Um, this isn't beautiful. You know, it's got scuffs and stuff like that. Um, but these are selling brand new on eBay right now, $300. Mine is not new. Uh, it's from, And these apparently are from the 90s or something. Um, I paid $25 for this. Now, Rally Roots talks about buying these. And when you sell them... Uh, they usually sell high, and they sell them as is. If there's a problem, um, they wind up, like, eating it. So, at $2.99, I think what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to price it at $1.75. And then when it goes on, then I'll, when I run a sale, it'll go down, like, 20 or 25%, if anybody's watching it. Uh, because I know for a fact they sold for $300 plus shipping, brand new. I, I'm surprised people even have these new. So, anyway, this is a uh, Toyota... Uh, S, it looks like 57016, right? What is that? 57016. Looks to be a CD player. It's got HD radio, and I'm assuming this is a GPS. Now, I do see a scratch in the front, but it is what it is. Um, there's all the info. You know, and, and that's what it looks like. Sometimes these sell for good money. Like I said... Uh, if I can put this on for 25 now, now it's heavy, so I'll put it in a box. It's probably going to, depending on where it goes, it'll cost like 15 to maybe 30 to ship. Whatever, that's fine. Uh, but that's my most interesting and for me unusual buy of the day because normally I would not buy this stuff unless I see I saw someone or someone told me to buy it. And while I was at the sale, I did check the price stats on it. There were none used, um, only this one for 300. So that's it. That's everything I got today. Um, if you want to find me. I will be at Clifton, and it looks like the weather will be warm enough. I'll probably be outside tomorrow. Uh, otherwise, um, do me a favor if you want, if you feel like it, uh, like my Facebook page. I'm trying to build that up. Uh, I just need more incentive to pay attention to it right now. If I get a bunch of likes, I'll I'll dedicate more time to it, and and uh, and um, just it, I'll make sure that there's stuff for people to be. To, to look at and to be, I don't know, whatever. Just like it for me. And also subscribe to my friends and their links are in, are in the thing. Anyway, I'm out of here. Bye. All right. Found this for free while we're walking back to the car. Uh, we paid only 25 bucks. This was the place that was a madhouse. Um, you know what? Do you have something I can lay it on? Here. No, stop, son. Uh, let me just put this here for a second. All right. You know, I didn't even get a chance to put my
glasses on yet, but go ahead, tell me what these are. Uh, I think these are Czechoslovakia and they're satin glass beads, but they're pretty. Yeah, they are very pretty. Uh, Czechoslovakian stuff would probably be from what, like the 30s, the 20s? Maybe a little bit earlier. Here, I'm gonna get nice and close on this. I'm still trying to get my glasses out. This is a handmade cross. And again, we only paid 25 for everything. And this was on an estate sale. This is like the end of the day when everything is picked, kind of. But you know what? There's a lot of stuff left there. You can go see on on another channel I'm doing um, where there's there was a lot of glass that for most people I think was kind of I don't know really kind of expensive. So you know. Oh, what is it? Is this like a bolo or something? No. no what's it's with the just tips? the end. That's how they ended it. So because the string would be frayed. Oh, okay. So they ended it with the uh, brass. So this is or a very copper. interesting quality That's piece. That's the back of it. No, I know that. I turned it around so I could see the back. Um, I would say this is a brutalist cross, right? I think so. Okay. And then I got this enamel. Yeah, this, this is kind of cool. This is really a very 60s. I guess it's not sign, right? Let's see. You didn't see a signature anywhere, did you? Here's, I'll show each panel. Like, this stuff is crazy. You can't get anything like this unless you do glass or enamel. Oh, this was broken. And this is a, how broken, let's say. Here, just put it right here. Well, it's missing two strands. I didn't realize. Is it? Oh, oh nasty. Oh, well. Yeah, but for what you It was paid. so dark in there. And, it was and so I happy. actually was using my uh, phone as a flashlight for you. So... I mean, maybe you could get it... I could still get five bucks for it, I think. I suppose. Maybe you can get it... It like... doesn't look horrible with one on one side. Yeah. And... This is a newer mm. piece. These pieces are from Turkey. Uh, this is the damage. Yeah, it's missing two strings. So that's everything you got for 15 Yeah. And then, and then these, I'll show these No, again. I got this for 10 Okay, so... Your dude was 5 so everything you got your jewelry for ten. Okay, but everything for your fifteen. Dude was five, yeah, I got and it. The paint, so the jewelry and was, the 10. was ten. When she gave you that cheap price on the jewelry, would you have bought more? No, because there was nothing else there for me. Okay. You know what was left had down. This is some kind of plaster. So I don't, I don't really know. Um, I don't see anything broken anywhere. I was like looking. Is he missing? No, look at his fist. It's like he looks like he's gonna punch something. No, he's holding his pack. Oh, yeah, okay. He's holding his pack. Yeah. And this, to me, looks like, like the religious things. There's maybe a little nick on the nose now, but that could easily be painted by someone who can paint stuff. Um, and then the last thing I got at that sale, which Marie found, is I got a little enamel painting. I think it's signed, what is that, DGM? Yeah, DJM. I don't know who that stands for. It's actually a decently done little one. See, it's got the two little girls uh, walking under the tree. I mean, it doesn't sound very exciting <laughs> with the way I described it. But this is an enamel on a copper painting. And I, I, I mean, I paid 10 for this. And something like this, if I put it on eBay, if I can figure out who DJM is, I'd probably mark it like, depending on what his stuff sells for. 50 and maybe up a little bit, you know. So, but I actually like these. I, I whenever I find them, I try and pick them up. Yeah, I can't imagine these are easy to do. I've got some some really nice ones that I have for expensive prices, but okay. So, basically, that's what we got at the sale. Um, if you want to see some of the stuff that was there, you can go to uh, I think I'll put that in a scummy resellers video, um, where I just walked around and took some pictures of some stuff. Uh, and then uh, after this, I'll show what I got at the other sales we went to today. Oh, total, we went to three sales, right? Yep. Three sales.